This fantasy football best ball edition of the Sports Gambling Podcast is presented by WinBet. Bet fifty dollars at WinBet and get two hundred dollars in free bets. Bet big, win bigger with WinBet. Download the WinBet app now or visit wynnbet.com and start winning today. We're also brought to you by Sleeper. You already play fantasy on Sleeper, but now you can win cold hard cash with their over under game. Just head to sleeper.com slash SGP on your phone to join the SGPN group and sleeper will automatically match your first deposit up to $100. That's sleeper.com slash SGP. And make sure to download the SGPN app, your home for all of our free picks and podcasts. Hey, what's up, you degenerate gamblers? This is Bill Burr, and you're listening to SGPN. Let it ride, baby. Welcome everyone to the sports gambling podcast. I'm Sean stacking the money green with my partner at picks, right? Real money Kramer. What's happening? Crane dog. Uh, I was not paying attention. Sorry, Sean. I was, I was thinking about two other things. Power just attempted to stop us. Yes. Cannot. Where's the undertaker meme? Where, where is it? <laughs> if you were watching, uh, don't stop us live on YouTube. You saw we, we were about 10 minutes in about to start the draft. Power grid uh, goes down. Shout out to the uh, great California <laughs> state power grid. Oh. Shut down everything. Stream kicked off. We hadn't started drafting yet. Although <laughs> I am, I, I, the draft that we had entered before we had actually started picking, I set that to auto draft. Ryan, breaking news. Oh, no. You will Who not you believe. Who do you have? Carson it, Wentz? No. Uh, AJ Brown. Oh. <laughs> the algorithm is so strong. It ended up still taking AJ Brown for me in the third round. Oh, but no man. worries, Ryan. We're back. We're better than ever. We're here to talk fantasy football on a Friday. Hey, you're looking to bet on some NFL, college football, NFL MVP, win total stuff. There is so much out there already. Why not head over to win bet? First off, bet $50, get $200 in free bets. And for every $500 you bet between now and the end of July, you are entered to win the ultimate fantasy football draft experience at the Encore Beach Club, including a two night stay at the Wind Resorts for you and your entire league. I mean, what are you, where are you guys going to have your draft? Down at Applebee's? Oh, it's not bad, but it's Applebee's. Why not at the beautiful Wind Resort? You and your buddies. Get all drunk, partying, hanging out. Check out the Blue Wire Studio. Maybe we'll be there recording an episode. Come in, say hi, give us a high five. Sounds like a hell of a weekend. You and 11 people. That's crazy. So much to choose from. All you have to do is download the WinBet app or visit WYNNBet.com to get started today. Offer subject to change, terms, conditions at winbet.com. This is 21 or older and present in the state where playthrough winbet is available. You or someone you know has a gaming problem, call 1 800 522 4700. Oh, Sean. I'm, yes. I, I'm, I am in two active drafts. Yes. Ryan is uh, auto drafting. I, I don't know how I feel about the team, but. Uh, Lamar Jackson, okay. Austin Eckler, Alvin Kamara, DJ Moore, mm. happy, CD Lamb, mm, oh. sad face. That's one. You want to hear the other one? Sure. What do you got? All right. Let's see. It, 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 dun, dun. Oh, that was the same one. Dun, dun. If you're brave enough to rejoin the uh, live YouTube stream, we will be hopping in. Don't oh. hit. Don't hate this one either. Jamar Chase, Tyree Kill, Alvin Kamara, Travis Etienne. Al- I'm gonna have a lot of Alvin Kamara from these auto drafts. Tyree Kill. I, am I Did too you say Tyree Kill? Tyree. I'm a- Tyree Kill. Uh, the like guy Tyree who's gonna Kill. be catching passes from two of this season. I, no thanks. It, it's a value based decision. All right, Sean. Should we head over yes. to the? Let's head over to the lobby. Underdog right. Fantasy again. Millions of prizes. Uh, if you haven't signed up already, UnderdogFantasy.com promo code SGPN. Hundred percent deposit bonus up to one hundred dollars. So essentially, seven four. people get in, Sean. We can right, do this. Let's All right, go. seven spots available. And, and breaking news: I will not 
be what, drafting. What do you mean? Jalen Hurts, Devonta Smith, or AJ Brown. I'm open to other Eagles. Okay. I was gonna say no Eagles, but that that's not realistic. Wow. But I'm not gonna be using any kind of earlier draft capital on the Eagles. I'm gonna force myself to really diversify my holdings. That's what the auto drafts for. Terry McLaurin just got to add to that team with Tyree Kill and Jamar Chase. Oh, Terry McLaurin. Do in, we, are we worried he's gonna hold out for a long time? Investing in bad quarterbacks. I, I don't know if I like this idea. I'm just gonna keep observing. I'm not gonna intervene. Let the auto draft happen. All right, let's find the draft to pop. What what pick are you? I I have not pulled off any premium stacks. Any premium stacks. I think this is the time. Does the any uh, strategy you want to try here? Mm, I don't know, like a zero RB. I feel like it would be fun to let, maybe we see where we're picking and we ba- and and then I just I'm gonna commit to a strategy. Okay, if I'm not based on the first, how if about, I'm not getting Jonathan Taylor, I may I may you uh, break out a zero RB, RB strategy. I yeah, like it. because uh, like the more I'm looking at these Christian McCaffrey and I like Eckler, but man. The you know the fact that they drafted Brees Hall does make me really kind of concerned. Uh, Sean, any Derek Henry, who again they, I was reading somewhere they said they think they have a twenty percent chance of re-injuring that foot just based on historical data. And again, he's, he's smashed all those historical averages before. Najee, who I, I think it's the volume, but he's put on a little weight and he was never he wasn't hyper efficient his rookie year. Dalvin Cook, we haven't even talked about the chance maybe he gets. Suspended briefly. He's always a little banged up. Um, yeah, you know, uh, Saquon Barkley. That's a complete punt for me. Well, so if you go zero RB, when what round do you take the first running back? I, Eight. I, I don't know if it's seven? different for best ball, but I think. Se- yeah, I think seven sounds right. Yeah, I think. Uh, yeah, maybe I'll hold myself to that, and I so won't draft a have, running back in the first six rounds. So you have a quarterback and all receivers. Yeah. Yeah. Um, um, so I think uh, traditionally, and I don't know if this is uh, for redraft or others, but round six is when you're looking to start the uh, best ball the, or sorry, the, uh, the, the running zero RB. Yeah. Ooh, that, that might be a fun way. I, I feel like I want to go premium stack. Okay. Cause you have been, you've been really going out of your way to draft some of the shittiest quarterbacks in the league, <laughs> including one Daniel Jones. Dan, you I have a lot, lot of, lot of, lot of, Mariota. Lot of Marcus Mariota, <laughs> Ryan, uh, pull up your QB uh, portfolio <laughs> if you don't mind. Cause I think, I think the listeners will get a laugh at it. Although, you know, you could make a case, especially this year. It feels like the, the floor for a, we, we a are bunch full. of quarterbacks are per, is is pretty high. We are full. Okay, we are full. We are on the clock. I will, I'll pull up my uh, my holdings in a second once we six. Okay, what do I do? Ooh, six. I'm is drafting interesting. ten. Oh, all right, we're both in positions where I think we can do whatever we want. Yeah, I don't think I. I'm probably not. I'm. I'm maybe holding to this zero RB uh, draft strategy. I, I mean, who are you hoping for here? It's got to be a receiver, right? Yeah, I think I'm going to probably lean pre- premium receiver because I'm not. Like oh, I said, I don't think I imagine myself getting a a running back that I like. Draft is live. I imagine first overall you got to go Jonathan Taylor. I you know you can get cute, but why? There's no point. If someone goes McCaffrey, how hard That's do you crazy. laugh at them? That's crazy. Yeah, I mean Christian McCaffrey, ba- he's he's uh you know, like a better version of Saquon Barkley. He at least lived up to the hype. For a longer amount of period, I mean Saquon Barkley it just has not been fantasy relevant for three years now, and people are acting like it, you know this stuff isn't going to impact him. It's just your your history. Saquon Barkley slanders. It hurts me. I so. mean, he was you know he had technically a thousand yards in 2019, but I I don't I don't remember him being particularly good. He's going to get so he had a great rookie year, and he's been a complete disappointment ever since. Jonathan Taylor, Cooper Cup, Justin Jefferson. Pretty stock. I, I mean, I, at this point, I feel like one, that's two, three. Unless, unless Chase sprinkles in there, McCaffrey seems to not. Be, I think McCaffrey will be more interesting once we get out to high stakes, mm. season long. I definitely see McCaffrey go more frequently in the FFPC in, in the top three than you do out here. So Christian McCaffrey just went number Could be four an age overall. Thing. 
I mean, who am I hoping for here? I, I think I'm pro am I probably hoping for chase to fall. Uh, I may, I may have to go Devonte Adams. Uh, I'm, I'm talking myself out of step. Yeah, I mean, digs. Jamar chase second. I mean, didn't think Jamar chase was going to land down here. So happy to take him. I think, I think pulling off a burrow stack would be nice. I've not done it yet. It would be the first one. I think it's doable. I think I might even be interested in in taking a T Higgins to 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 sprinkle in here. So Kramer goes Jamar Chase. Derrick Henry was taken before you. Eckler right after you. I thought you might have gone Eckler there, Ryan. I have said that I don't love teams where I don't come away with a running back in the first couple of rounds. I'll roll the dice here and hope one gets back to me. I think Jamar Chase so is ceiling on Jamar Chase too high, especially in the weeks we care about. Where's my damn schedule? Grid? Stefan Diggs, Najee Harris go right in front of me. Now I could go Dalvin cook here, but I think I'm going to lean in and, and give a whirl on this zero RB strategy and take uh <laughs> Devonte Adams. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I mean, it's I half like point that. PPR, but I, I don't have a lot of shares of them. I also like the way that you're able to load up with Hunter Renfro. Darren and Waller, probably. Well, you don't. You don't. You can. You can go Waller too, and get Carr much later. It's a very manageable stack where you have the whole offense. I think we we agree that they're going to be able to move the ball. I don't know how many games they win. I'd I'd bet on them to be a a, a frisky offense for sure. I don't know how, what where the running game works into that. Maybe you sneak a uh, what Zamir White late. You know, this is crazy because I I think I might actually go. So right after I'm drafted, DeAndre Swift, Dalvin Cook, Travis Kelsey goes. Now uh, auto drafter is in is in the spot ahead of me. I think I might actually oh, go. Took DeAndre Swift and oh, Aaron Jones. Aaron Jones. I might actually go Mark Andrews here, Ryan. Really? What do you think about going premium Woo! tight end here? Why not? If you are you going, you're going to go zero RB. Yeah, I'm going to lean into it. Cause I think there's a world where I can get Lamar and uh double stack Derek Carr is my like backup stack. <laughs> double stack with Devontae Adams is is a pretty So where am I going here? That's, That's the question. C D Lamb just went. Yeah, I don't know. You you went receiver. I'd imagine you're probably gonna take Saquon Barkley. You're a you're a disgusting homer. Joe Mixon, Mike Evans, Debo's uh, up there, Tyreek, who uh, man, I I, you know, the two I hate aside and some of it's kind of a joke, but man, I, I, I just think Waddle is, is going to be the guy that's ends up being more efficient and, and better fantasy wise. Like I, I see the impact of Tyree kill in a game, but fantasy wise, I just don't see him being consistently good. All right, like, we're going to, we're going to, okay. we're going to overdraft to, to accomplish the goal here, which is premium stack. Let's load up with this, this Bengals team. I, I I'm intrigued how Sean earlier this off season, where was I getting T Higgins end of the third round? Yeah, I believe I might've even drafted him in the fourth round. So his stock all the way, his ADP Sean has crept into the second round. Tyree kill just went off the board right after your uh, T Higgins selection. I'll be honest. That's not who I was debating. Who are you debating, right? It was a running back. <laughs> I, I will not say his name because I have been less in love with teams where I don't have Ryan that that Saquon Barkley that very uh, running back just went off the board Saquon Barkley. We're talking fantasy. Uh, we just dusted off our old uh, season long dynasty league oh, over no. on Sleeper, and now uh, now you're probably already playing fantasy and Sleeper, but now just click over and you can get in on that new over under game. So easy to uh, play and uh, super fun, man. You, again, all you're doing is picking. It's like over under player stats for baseball. The baseball is live, ready. Can't wait to get down over at sleeper.com/slash SGP. Hundred percent deposit match up to one hundred dollars, and you join our sleeper squad. So I'm gonna be looking to copy some of uh, Moon off, uh, you know, Scotty Reichel. Uh, you know, Noah, Malcolm, some of these, some of our baseball guys, Scott's required, this. Scott's required to participate sleeper.com slash SGP. Get that hundred percent deposit match. Join our squad. You can copy our picks. We can copy yours. Terms and conditions apply. See sleepers terms of use for details. So after Barkley, Michael Pittman, Debo Samuel, AJ Brown. Wow. End of the second round for AJ Brown, <laughs> Mike Williams, Keenan Allen, Josh Allen, Kyle Pitts. 
I mean, even as an AJ Brown fan, uh, that feels a little high. I've officially unchecked <laughs> the running back box, Ryan. Really? Yep. Bold move. All right. So if we're being real, yeah, are we, we are. are we being? Is this real space? I, I'm waiting for the pick to happen because I know I'll get screwed. Did I get screwed? I didn't get screwed. Javante Williams goes right. Why? In front of why him. has Leonard Fournette not gotten drafted yet? He's Playoff playing with. Tom, he's playing with Tom Brady, right? Yeah. I need a RB one. I'm I'm okay with that because I honestly Fournette and Barkley are in the same spot for me, and Barkley went way earlier. Sean, I think the uh, you're starting to see the league sharpen up. I did pass on uh, Kamara. What's oh, the okay. deal with Kamara? I don't know. I I mean, and he just got drafted. Oh, there. the auto draft is loading me up with Kamara share. So tell me, tell me about Kamara. Yeah, I mean, is he gonna miss games? I don't know. He he punched a dude in the face. If he doesn't miss games, I love his value this round. I don't think he's gonna miss multiple games. Sound I, if I had to guess, just one game. Hmm. And it sounds like uh, you know all the latest stuff is Deshaun Watson. They're expecting him to be suspended the entire year. Browns now I'm sure they're really gonna scared. try and appeal it. Again, you look at the way that contract was structured. He only gets a million dollars this first year because you know he could lose his entire salary. Uh, James Conner goes, who I like in the third round. Uh, Nick Chubb. I'm on the clock. Real talk. The Browns are fucking stupid. Yeah. Interesting spot here, Ryan, because I'm I'm sticking to my um, not taking a running back here. I think I'm going to draft uh, Jalen Waddle. I mean, I, I get Tyreek Hill is going to come in and and compete you are, for catches, but I I think that's you are a Waddle guy. Uh, you seem to be landing on him. I, I yeah, I, I like him in this spot. C -c I think the checkdown aspect is is there. He has a chemistry. He had 104 catches last year. I don't think Tyreek's going to eat into his volume. I, I'm wondering if you're how you're building your roster, because man, you could maybe look to go two tight ends and also, uh, you know, achieve some interesting success from a roster construction standpoint. Ryan, I think I know the player you're talking yeah. about. He's in my queue. I'm trying to be cool, like you know, we're all cool here, but sometimes the chat's not cool. Yeah, and they take guys we like. Patrick Mahomes goes two more than me. Uh, Marquise Hollywood Brown of oh, the Arizona Cardinals goes. I, I want no part of that. A end of the it, third round. I that's, just that's a guy I'm going to be real wrong on this year. What do you mean? Like I'm not going to be on him at all, and he's in a situation where he could do something. I yeah. mean, he's going from a but team then DeAndre that runs Hopkins the like. I'm just saying he's going from a team that wants to run the ball period to a team that wants to throw the ball and does a lot in low value ways where he can make a play. That, that's all I'm saying. Deontay Johnson goes right in front of me, DJ Moore, And then I select Darren Waller. I wasn't planning on getting no. two elite tight ends, but this zero RB strategy well, really, helps you can you now, that. I assume they have different bye weeks Hopefully didn't check. Yes, that ahead of they time. do. Uh, you can now go head first zero. Like you can get even another running back position now. You know what I mean? What do you mean? I think you only need two tight ends. Oh yeah. So you can use an extra position on running back. So you're really, you're figure you're doing this. Well, thank my you. My friend, I think I, I like the way that you've pivoted. Yeah. It wasn't the DJ Moore go. Damn it. He did. Yeah. I'm not paying it. I'm almost on the clock. Sean Zeke went right before me. <laughs> where where are we on Terry McLaurin? It's just bad quarterback, right? Yeah, uh, and I think they're. I mean, you know what? I'm gonna overdraft this guy a little bit, but you know the sharp cats out there will see what I'm up to. I take Gabe, Gabe Davis. Davis. Love Gabe Davis this year. Week 17, Bills play the Bengals. Yeah, that could be a real shoot at. Gabe Davis, Justin Herbert goes. So we're seeing a little bit, a little bit of the quarterbacks. I'm over drafting for a purpose. They say you're not supposed to do that. It's not, it's not worth it. They say they say a lot of things, Ryan. They do including that trade coffee is delicious and they're right. Oh yes. Love me some trade coffee starting every day with those oh, freshly roasted beans. And again, it, it's awesome. Cause it's dialed in exactly to your taste. You take a little coffee quiz. Hey, I like these flavors. I don't like these flavors. 
They send you a bag customized to your taste. And then they, uh, you know, they give you a bunch of different batches. I love the whole beans, just grinding those up. The taste is so good. I'm a big pour over guy too. So mm. I'll sometimes if you want like a really strong cup, grind up your own beans, get some hot water, get a little pour over going and uh, especially good beans. You life is too short for shitty coffee. It really is. Don't punish yourself with that bad office drip coffee. That's just been sitting there. Have you ever been to like a Jiffy lube, the kind of coffee they sit out there. Don't do that to yourself. Enjoy that, that jolt that caffeine gives you and treat yourself to some great taste. Trade has delivered over 5 million bags of fresh coffee with more than 750,000 positive reviews. New subscribers, a total of $30 off your first order plus free shipping. Just go to drinktrade.com slash SGP. That's more than 40 cups of coffee for free. Take the coffee quiz over at drinktrade.com slash SGP and let trade find you a coffee. You'll love drinktrade.com slash SGP for $30 off. Justin Herbert, Terry McLaurin, Rashad Bateman, damn it. Cam Akers, damn it. Allen Robinson, Brandon Cooks, George Kittle. What are we doing here, Sean? Well, I was going to try and get, um, I was really looking to grab my buddy Rashad Bateman. Uh, I was kind of bummed. He, he went relatively early, maybe not depending on, on where you got these guys. I mean, I wonder I, you might, you might consider Allen Robinson, Brandon cooks, George Kittle, Darnell Mooney, oh. Travis ETN. You know, I was going to open five the, picks away, Ryan. I was going to open the Travis ETN basket. Really? And I was going to ask you about him. Uh, for me or for you? For me. Really? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know. I'm worried about that Jacksonville offense. Darn. Um, David Montgomery goes who I I've liked in previous years, but man, Khalil Herbert, I think is really nipping at his heels. All right. I, I need to, to have another running back. I love the situation. Um, not being scared off by any injury news yet. JK Dobbins. <laughs> I, maybe I could have waited around. I don't think I could have waited around. The other considerations here were, you know, the receivers like DK Metcalf, where, you know, I think maybe they have a, a decent floor, but maybe not the highest ceiling. DK Metcalf just went two more picks than me. Uh, I'm staring down the barrel. I'm sweating it out, Ryan. Will the guy I have in my queue be selected? I mean, I I'm gonna tell you who to pick when it gets to you. Brees Hall goes. So I I. What's your take on him? Juju Smith Schuster goes. Okay, so Juju DK and uh, D- JK Dobbins were my cluster of okay. players. Juju was interesting, but I, I just I'm not doing the zero RB, so I wanted to walk away with another running back with it. Yes, Lamar Jackson. So now I got Lamar, Devontae Adams, Jalen Waddle, Mark Andrews, Darren Waller. Oh, uh, I'll have to keep my eye on Derek Carr, unfortunately, I, for stacking purposes. I have Team Envy right now. And uh, Hunter Renfro as well. I'm gonna officially I have five guys. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna start oh. let's start looking at some uh running backs, Ryan. Is it time? Well, I I'm three picks I, away. Oh, you know what? I'll, maybe I'll do one more receiver because I don't want Josh Jacobs. He is on a team that you're investing in. Who do the Raiders play week 17? It's a good question. I'm looking it up. Where's your you. schedule I, card? I, I don't, don't. Am I crazy to draft? Am I crazy to overdraft Hunter Renfro here? <laughs> no, I. You were making fun of me when I was high on him. Yeah. That was different, though. That was you. Now it's me. Okay. And I'm I'm looking at this Derek Carr stack. Oh, what, got what's your to, what's your take on Amari Cooper in the sixth round? Uh, Jacoby Brissett can he carry a fantasy receiver? Probably not. All right, so I'm Dra- so, draft for a purpose. You know what you want to do. I know I'm you just, could bring it back with Elijah Mitchell as your first running back RB zero. Oh yeah, Hunter <laughs> Renfro. All right, so I got Devonte Adams, Jalen <laughs> Waddle, Hunter Renfro, Lamar Jackson. Mark Andrews, Darren Waller. I mean, I'm I'm feeling pretty good, actually. <laughs> I mean, so and and there are some decent options at running back: Elijah I, Mitchell, AJ Dillon, Clyde edwards Lair, Miles Sanders, Antonio Gibson. I, w- I don't. Yeah, I, I think you probably want some. Oh, you son of a bitch! 
Fuck you. Ryan is responding. You, you ruined the, the whole Joe episode. Burrow is drafted right before he couldn't pair Jamar Chase. Wait, you have Chase and Higgins, right? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, and Gabe Davis as a bring back. Oh, you're just stacking for that week. I love it. I mean Well, sorry, you were. Big fuck you. All right, I'm gonna take Drake London. Load up on my pass catchers. Fuck you. I can we I don't even want to finish this draft. <laughs> I, I I that per, if that that person's in the chat. They had to have been. Ah, oh, that's horrible. All right, so uh Kramer settles for Drake London, rookie receiver in the sixth round in that Atlanta offense. Are you a little worried? No. Okay. That's why I took him, Sean. <laughs> uh, so Marcus I was, I'll be honest. Loading. I was I'm flustered right now because why the fuck would you reach on Joe Burrow? I'm clearly building a team. You see what's being constructed here. Now what am I going to do? Now what am I going to do, Sean? That's a great question. That Fuck. is a great question. This game is stupid. <laughs> All these young fantasy wannabe control. Go home. It's De it's Devonta a stupid Smith game. Goes, Josh Jacobs, Elijah Mitchell, Antonio Gibson. So stop even. Why are we listening to this? My, well, Ryan, my some of these uh, running backs I was planning on grabbing uh, are getting are getting snagged up. So maybe I should have waited on Hunter Renfro. But I love that. No, I'm done being happy stack. for you having a nice team. This oh, wow. fucking guy probably in the in the chat. He's watching. Got, he's got big chat vibes. Listening to to the intel I'm sharing with you. I'm just not going to talk on these episodes anymore. <laughs> Jokes on you. Dalton Schultz, Russell Gage. I'm still flustered. We're 10 picks past the moment. I'm still I'm I'm angry. I'm at, I'm not ready to go 24 hours straight yet. Right. Uh, and shout out to Andrew Rob who's been all over this, but uh, Damian Pierce, the I'm Texans pissed. running back, has been getting some rumblings as the uh, number one RB out of there. Yeah. Any thoughts? Yeah. Not, are you gonna share them? I mean, I like taking a stab there, right? New coaching staff. You there lots of good reasons why. Maybe I mean, especially with some you know, someone trying to pull off a strategy. Hopefully you don't get fucked over. <laughs> Hopefully there's not a real asshole out there. <laughs> it's just going to ruin your fucking day. What do you think about Melvin Gordon? I, I know we like Javante Williams better as a player, as a talent, but Melvin Gordon just kind of always sees the field. He's, he's hard to get rid of. I mean, even last year he had 918 yards, eight touchdowns, 28 catches. And if Javante Williams gets banged up at all, he's, he's in line for like a massive upside. Oh, I'm st I, I just can't. I can't see. I'm seeing red right now. I'm just seeing DeAndre red. Hopkins. Michael Thomas goes. Kramer's on the clock, red. and he takes Tom Brady in the seventh round. I'm wow, he is rattled. <laughs> he is. You're I'm, drafting a good quarterback in the middle. I'm. 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 Well, oh I. God. I wanted a goddamn quarterback this time. I have Leonard Fournette <laughs> and Tom Brady stack. What happened to your premium stacks? Uh, and you missed out on Russell Gage, Ryan. Ryan is rattled. This is uh, we've been uh, working on adding a second studio, like at, putting the foam up. And I'm, Ryan, I'm just Ryan, auto, you I'm, smelled too much glue. I'm auto draft. You smelled too much team. glue putting the foam up. I'm, I'm worried about you. Fuck everyone. Alan Lazard, who again sneaky uh, trash. <laughs> great pick, great pick, asshole. Brandon Ayuk, great pick, and one more, and then me. Got a uh, got a running back in here, Ryan. I I I hope you I really hope you nail it, Sean. Psych. Dal, uh, Dakota Rain Prescott just drafted. I'm taking. Where's and I will be drafting Mr. Miles Sanders, first running back. Okay, like it. God damn it. Right. Am I? Can I lean on you for some running back advice, or are you sure? Too what do you need? Who, oh, you took Miles Sanders. Of course, you took Miles. Now do I what do I do for my second uh, running back? You should t Kareem Hunt. It's a disgusting act, but the the right the, Tony Pollard? The right answer is out there. Mm, can't do that, Ryan. Zero RB requires taking Zeke's backup because Zeke was taken <laughs> like five rounds ago. Traylon Burks just goes, that's an auto draft if Ze I ever saw it. Zeke's one. not even on the screen he was taken so long ago. That's crazy. Tony Pollard's gonna be lining up and running routes. 
Clyde Edwards, Elair, Sky Moore. The absolute right answer here is to take Tony Pollard. Are you bullying me, Ryan? No. I'm just trying to help you achieve something since Dickhead, what's his name? Call him out. I can't even read. Da- Daro one four one three. It's a it's this guy doesn't even know how to count. Daro. Daro's a real piece of shit. Hey, Daro. Sky Moore. <clears throat> One more, and then me. Uh, Christian ruined. Kirk just goes. Everything I've been working. So you, you think I should take Tony Pollard over Kareem Hunt? Yes. All right, I'll do if it. You want to? I mean, you know, look, you're a grown man. You can do whatever the fuck you want, John. <laughs> all right. How many? Uh, how many receivers are you looking to get to? Six? Just taking all quarterbacks now. I'm ruining the draft for everyone else. Uh, receivers. Yeah. The six is like the bare. I, I don't. I'm not gonna feel great if I got six. Let's see. What's the? I got the grid right here. Roster construction grid. Troy. Uh, T.J. Hawkinson goes. It's not Russell Wilson. Mm, interesting. Yeah, I'd say you want to have at least six. More, more than if you can get to seven, that's probably better. But. Oh, I'm on the clock, and look who was taken right before me. Oh, Kadarius Tony Ryan, this is just a a horrible draft top to bottom. Is conspiring (laughs) against me, so I'm just gonna take a running. Kenneth Walker, wow. No, he's Ken, bro. Ken Walker, you didn't see the update? I did. Don't be a disrespectful member of the media. (laughs) Don't be like Daro. Who Daro take? Daro took. His, I'm, I'm going to turn this fucking table over. This is a troll job if I've ever seen. I one. feel like I'm Mark Wal. Wait, was it Mark? I feel like I'm Mark Wahlberg in that sniper movie. Where where are they watching us? Jason Bourne is across the fucking street. <laughs> Get Colby in here with my sandwich. Fuck. You're gonna, don't. Ryan. This guy took Kadarius Tony. Well, I apologize for being uh, a little overly emotional. There's a real cocksucker in our draft. Uh, he's, he's managed to find a spot under my skin. Kareem Hunt, Tyler Lockett. This is re- this is truly unbelievable. All right, I need a Panther. Bring. Oh back. my God. Trey Lance, Ryan. Do you just go full villain uh, lineup and and villain. all the guys you hate? I'm not a villain. No, but you're. How dare you call me a villain? They're villains to you. Damian Harris. What do we think about him this year? I think this is hilariously late that he's still available. I mean, New England feels like one of the teams you could end up with two running backs in best ball, and not wouldn't be the horrible, most horrible situation. I know it's always a a bit of a you know roll of the dice Patriots running backs, but this late God, I'm so I'm so broken. This guy, this Daro guy, broke me right now. I, I, this Melvin Gordon just went. MVS goes. Trey Lance. This isn't going to be Kramer's good, coming up in a couple picks. This isn't gonna still be, visibly rattled. This isn't a good podcast. We should just we should cancel it. <laughs> No one wants right, to get hear Aaron Rodgers. You you wanted premium quarterbacks. Is Aaron Rodgers still available? Yeah, Man, I took Tom Brady early. Why'd you let me take Tom Chris Brady? So early? <laughs> that was you drafting Tom Brady was when someone you take someone's keys and then you're not paying attention. They just come over and grab them out of your hands, make a beeline for the door. Uh, who are you gonna take? Maybe I'll just ruin your draft. No, you can't do that, right? Real dickhead. All right, A Rod off the board. One more than you, Ryan. <clears throat> yeah, I'm ready. James Cook. I know you've been fancying him. No, it's receivers. Oh, they got okay. three good running. Oh, Tyler Boyd to go with your. Oh, never mind. You didn't get the pro <laughs> stack. Dallas Goddard. Oh, so funny. Kramer's on the clock. What are you doing, Kramer? I mean, playing rookie darts. 
one of them's going to hit, right? Got Drake London and Garrett Wilson now. Can't miss. Well, the point is, I might miss with one, but one I won't miss with. Getting a little nervous, right? Not going to lie. Damian Harris goes. Damn it. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I do feel bad. No, that, that was a. I, I was shocked he was this uh, available this late. Oh, Chase, Chase Claypool. Chase Claypool goes. He was in draft, consideration. Goes in front of me. I'm gonna have to pull the trigger on one Derek Carr. Yeah. Just so, oh. just because of the stack, I don't want to miss him. You see who? You see who fucked you? Who? You see who picked? Oh, Darrow, uh, fourteen, thirteen. He must be listening. He's not. He's yeah, fuck he, this Darrow. He's, he's gotta too, be listening. He's too scared to weigh in on the YouTube chat. He's, he's just creating snipe all our guys. He's gonna be responsible for the greatest mock draft podcast episode ever. That's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> for personally unraveling Ryan multiple times. All right, now it just looks like we're gonna pile up some receivers, running backs. I'm so angry. Why Devin did he Singlet do that? <laughs> Devin Singletary goes. Ah, oh, see, I feel like you have to end up with one of the Bills running backs with your strategy, right? Yeah. And I got one sitting in the queue, Ryan. Don't fuck. Don't fuck Sean. Michael over. Gallup goes. Auto draft might take no, him. No, don't do it. Auto draft's probably gonna take him. Although, <clears throat> looking down the board, there we there's still some running backs that I I mean, you know, the Chase Edmonds thing is real, I think. I think it is the investment in him is real. In Miami, huh? Mm-hmm. They pay I mean, he's getting paid. There is some truth to that, at least from like a starting point. All right. Kenny Galladay yeah, goes. So you're going to take Cook. James Cook, baby. Nice. So my running backs rounding out Miles Sanders, Tony Pollard, James Cook, three receivers, Devontae Adams, Jalen Waddle, Hunter Renfro, two tight ends, Mark Andrews, Darren Waller, and two quarterbacks, Lamar <laughs> and Derek Carr. I, I don't know if I need a third quarterback. I think I'm just going to lay down a bunch of uh, running back receiver bullets the rest of the ride. I still can't believe it would have been fine. It would have been fine. Everyone could have been happy. I mean, Ramon J Stevenson, I, I don't want to take him now, but he's why not? Yeah, maybe I will. Who the fuck knows what they're going to do. You know, he's a big bruising back. Jahan Dotson. He's fun. I don't know if he's worth it. And, uh, Oh my God. Chase Edmonds goes. Tyler Boyd goes. Kramer, I'm sure it was in your queue. I mean, he was gonna happen. That was gonna happen next. <laughs> Ooh, Jamison Williams, Ryan. You, I know you're building the all rookie squad. He's kind of an interesting shot there. This is this has just been a hard draft to to really <laughs> Why are you upset, Ryan? Oh, no, poor no, Ryan. Not upset. Oh, you can get Jameis Winston. All right. I, I have not done this yet, but we know Pete Carroll loves to run the rock. So let's take Ken Walker and Rashad Penny. Hmm. And just, I mean, one of those guys is scoring for me each week, right? The interesting track. It sounds like uh, Chris Carson's no longer going to be playing football. I'm sure I'll get killed for this strategy. I don't mind it. What are your thoughts, Sean? By the way, you saw Daro took Pat Fryermuth. Someone you were high on. Yep. Real Daro must be a listener. Rondale Moore, Christian <laughs> Watson goes, Ramondre Stevenson goes. All right. He doesn't have to continue to be a listener. <laughs> no. I, I, you don't have to listen. Just sign up for the promo codes. And yeah. Tim Patrick. I, don't know, I I like Tim Patrick as a talent, but man, that is just it's only one football, Ryan. It just seems like a very crowded situation in Denver. People do seem high on him, like higher than they should be. Oof. The talent at the running back position really falls off at this point. What do you mean? I got, I got a couple. Uh, I got like three gems lined up. Yeah. 
Well. Her cousins go Zach Ertz, Jarvis Landry, Alexander Madison. He was one of the gems. Fortunately for me, Darrow can't fuck me this time. No, that is great news for you. Two picks away, Ryan. What are your thoughts? Your th- my thoughts? Yeah. Anyone there popping out to you? For you? Because I, I uh, see Justin Fields, but he just got drafted. Tua, he's fun. I mean, what are you looking to do? You only have one quarterback. Up oh, two, it just got drafted. Mm. Zero tight ends. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I'm not tight end. Will will be later. Um, you know what? I I don't I don't have to quit on that winning the championship part. Let's bring it back some more. Gabe Davis and Jamison Crowder to go with T Higgins and Jamar Chase. I know I got screwed over by Daro. Yeah, but you you got um, some almost stacks. Miko Hardman off the board. Well, Tom Brady stacked with a running back is always useful. Are you? I mean, and I also the other guy I was gonna take. I'm pretty sure is top of your queue right now, and so hopefully you get him. I hope Ronald Jones goes. I, I hope it doesn't go horribly wrong for you like it did for me. Ah. <laughs> uh. It hurts, Sean. It, it Joe Burrow stack was what I wanted. Yeah. This whole episode ruined. Damian Pierce goes. Oh, Damn that it. hurts. That's who I was gonna take instead of Crowder. All right. Maybe I just go to a receiver. I do need more receivers. <laughs> Jamison <laughs> Williams. How many running backs do you have? I have three. Oh, okay. Three running backs, four receivers now. Who are the running ends. backs? Let's hear. Miles Sanders, Ooh. Tony Pollard, James Cook. Ah, that's not horrible. They all have well, Cook, I guess, needs to win the role, but they all seem to have roles. Yeah. They're, I mean, they're all gonna see the field. Little bummed out I wasn't able to get Dawson Knox. Do think I I need to start putting some tight ends into my queue. Yeah, Ryan. Come on. I'm gonna go completely crazy with no tight ends. I have six r- wide receivers, four running backs, one quarterback, no tight ends. Very interesting strategy. It's not. It's just not time yet. Is this the draft where I also throw in uh, Robbie Anderson? Oh, I was looking there because he's the <laughs> bring back for Tom Brady. What? Oh, in that week in that seventeen. Game. Oh yeah, all right. I like where our heads at. I don't know if we should. We, I, I think we agreed we were going to quit Robbie Anderson. Yeah, but then that's when you hop on, right? All right. Jahan Dotson goes. Gasecki goes. Uh, White, the running back for the Bucks, he's also off the board. Jamison Crowder. That felt like a good pick there. Yeah. Knock Thanks. yourself into it. Is Robbie Anderson available? Oh yeah. All right, I'm on the clock. Need some more running backs. Give me Isaiah Spiller. Like the situation there. Eckler injury history. You're gonna have so much of him. I can't. I mean, again, where? How high did they draft him? I I'm actually. You don't. We'll see when it gets oh, to me. But it's the fourth round. But still, man, like that guy. He is. I don't know. He just fits that mold of rookie running back who just blows up and has way more work than people thought. Uh, I'm a little surprised you didn't take this guy because we like him, and it, it he almost certainly has a role. I know they drafted uh, Brees Hall, but Michael Carter was a productive yeah. member of that passing unit. He was definitely someone I considered. Again, it's the Jets' offense, so. Kind of get what you don't you think? I mean, we've kind of talked about it all off season how they could take a step forward. That's not crazy. We like Zach Wilson. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not opposed to it. I you're you're mad you didn't take him. No, you? no, a no. I I like you I, I like having a ton of Isaiah Spiller shares, yeah. especially in this upside build. <laughs> I'm just uh, locking up Isaiah Spiller left and right. Speaking of lock, you know what your lock is for internet security, safety, privacy. IP vanish. That's right. I was always kind of hesitant 
to use a VPN. I'm like, oh, it's going to be a pain in the ass. I got to get it for multiple devices, multiple accounts. It's going to slow down my browsing and whatever nefarious things I'm up to. No, IP vanish super fast, super safe, encrypts all your data. Uh, you can hide your location. You can even put it on streaming media devices like a fire stick. And the best part is the price, man. 70% off their yearly plan and a 30 day money back guarantee. It's like getting nine months for free. All you got to do is go to ipvanish.com slash SGP and use that promo code SGP claim your 70% savings ipvanish.com slash S G P catch people up on the uh, recent draftings, Van Jefferson, Jacoby Myers, Bobby Tunyon, uh, Williams running back on the Cardinals, Naheem Hines, uh, Darnell Henderson, Marvin Jones, Jamison Winston, Kramer, you're almost up. Uh, DJ Chark. That's a great pick right there. I was thinking of, of taking him as well. You have the other guy, right? I have Jamison Williams. I mean, who's the number two receiver in Carolina? Is it still Robbie Anderson? <laughs> it Is it Robbie be. Anderson? One of one Baker comes right. there. They let's they go. hang Robbie out Anderson, friends. baby. Let's go. Devontae Parker. Robbie Anderson. Is that over drafting? Oh, I don't know. What's his ADP? I have seven receivers now. Okay. Hmm. Now four. Five running backs, one quarterback, still no tight ends. Probably should have taken a tight end. Who should my first tight end be? I see some I like. Oh, Sean, are you? Will you be taking uh, Kenneth Gainwell? No, because I already have uh, Miles Sanders. They are going to run the rock a lot. No, I, 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 I don't mind it. I just in this, I need like massive upshot guys um, for my build. Uh, Pierce goes to the Colts. I'm going Khalil Herbert again. I have a running back for you. Oh, who? All right, I'll let you have him on the way back. Okay. Because I'm that kind of. Even though Daro is in here fucking shit up, he took a cowboy to show. Kenny me. Gainwell goes. I'll give you a guy. Yeah. Because that's what we do here. We give each other guys. <laughs> KJ Osborne goes. Great pick. Brian Robinson's an interesting, again, best ball guy for sure. I don't know. It's it's kind of a crowded backfield, but they seem to be committed to him. How many rounds do we have left, Sean? Uh we're in round fourteen. Five picks. Five, five picks, picks for me. I'm next up on the clock. Excited to hear who Ryan has for me. Uh, I mean, I let's see. How is John Mechie's ADP higher than Nico Collins? Gerald Everett goes. All right, Ryan. Who who do you suggest? Oh, you, what, back? what does Shanahan love to draft? A fresh new piece of running back every year. I assume Davis he, Price. Yeah. Right. All right. I mean, you want to, if you're going to take a bullet, isn't that the kind of bullet you want? Yep. All right. Let's go. All right. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. Yeah. You're welcome. I have four picks left, two receivers, two running backs. And that will get me, although I have six running backs already. Maybe Uh, I don't need a, maybe I just, aren't you bullets? Aren't the, isn't the zero RB that you gotta, you gotta take extra shots, extra bullets. But I only have four receivers. Oh, but I have two you, tight ends that are awesome. You don't need any more tight ends. No. Yeah, you don't need more tight ends. No, I no I, more tight ends. I'm saying how many? Absolutely. I have four <laughs> spots left. How many receivers? How many running backs? Oh. Uh, I would I would go seven running backs. I think. Yeah. And then everything else at receiver. How many quarterbacks do you have? Two. Yep. I feel good with those. Two. Who are the two quarterbacks? Lamar and uh, Derek Carr. Yeah, you don't need uh, the bye weeks are different. Yep. And I still see some running backs that you know, I would put my eye on if I were you. 
Zach Wilson goes quarterbacks are flying off the board. I might as well take my backup now since it is the highest. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's stre- let's, let's get a little bit more of the Seattle offense. No offense. First tight end, uh, you know, comes over with the chemistry. So now you, Ryan, you, your, your plan was to draft premium stacks and you have Tom Brady and no one else and Leonard Fournette. Oh, is that the premium stack you had in mind? Darrow fucked everything up. No, okay. Remember? And yeah. I was I, honestly, Sean, do you know who I was about to draft? Hayden Hurst. This cocksucker Darrow takes Hayden Hurst one pick before me. <laughs> That's not funny. I just gave it's you a great funny. pick. I just gave you a great pick. We we seem to be uh, on the same page. You don't like Darrow. He's a real piece of shit. Sandbag and son of a bitch is what Colby would call him. I agree. Uh, what do we got here? Latest picks: Algier uh, goes running back from Atlanta. Corey Davis, Jamal Williams, Danny Dimes making it all the way to Fuck. the fourteenth round. I was thinking about taking him there. I took Fan over him. Feel horrible about this team. Really do. Lavisca Chenault, is this the year, Ryan? I don't know. Whatever you want. <laughs> uh, Despondent Kramer is great. I mean, Lavisca Chenault has some production, man. Yeah, I, to, I might have to slide that guy up my queue. George Pickens goes. The guy I considered drafting. I don't understand why Chanel is dropping so so far. Yeah, I mean, I I think I could see Doug P using him a bunch. And correct me if I'm wrong, but wasn't Trevor Lawrence like making a case for him? Yeah. Yeah. Double yeah. I I still can't believe this guy took Joe Burrow. I was open with you guys. Will Fuller went. Are you drafting Will Fuller, Ryan? No. Doesn't have a team right now. I don't quite understand the drafting of Will Fuller. I mean, it's got to play somewhere, I guess. What can can we t- discuss? Well, I don't, I, actually, you know what? Let's not discuss it until we get a little closer. You're talking about Quez Watkins, <clears throat> aren't you? No. All right, Tyler Higby went. Why did Tyler? Why is Tyler Higby falling so far? Just because there's so many things in that offense. Is that all it is? No, no comment. Um, hmm. sorry, Ryan. Bevmo was texting me. They oh, only Jesus have three Christ. cases of grapefruit Lacroix. <laughs> so sorry, Ryan. I was that's trying personal. To, I was trying personal, to help uh, you out. Any other citrus flavors? Uh, I need to bleep that out. <clears throat> what? Yeah, any other citrus flavor works. Thanks. <laughs> now you're gonna get lemon cello because oh, they consider um, at most sane people consider lemon a citrus. Right, Curtis Samuel goes uh, supposedly building a lot of chemistry with Carson Wentz in oh! the Commandos. What do we do here? Kramer drafts Cameron Bray. We'll stack for Tom Brady. Oh, you got to draft Gronk with this team, Ryan, since it's so bad. <laughs> what do you mean it's bad? Raheem Mostert goes. Cameron Bray could be sneaky. Yeah. <laughs> sneaky out of his job. That's not funny. That's a little funny. Is Gronk coming back? No, he's just uh Wow. He's just gonna place your <laughs> place your bets, please. Oh, it's a reminder to pick up Bev Melrod. Yeah. I feel you. KJ Hamler goes. Do I need another quarterback or do I just go with Tom Brady? <laughs> Evan Ingram goes. How has Lavisca Chanel not been drafted? Sixty-two catches. People don't year. like him. Zero touchdowns. I think he's he's not ma- up for a people don't like him. Massive regression, aka progression. David Bell goes, who a lot of people are ha- high on. Positive regression is the way you say that. No, that's what you. Help, help that's what out. I always say, and then you say no, that's wrong. Matt Ryan, Ugh. Matty Ice. I would not. I, don't know. I wouldn't touch that one. In fantasy? With your dick. Fantasy? No. I wouldn't fuck him with B. Arthur's dick. Remember that from the roast? Jeffrey Ross. It's a pretty good line. Oh, God bless Jeffrey Ross. Sammy Watkins goes. 
We just made it into the 16th round. Wow, things are getting exciting here. Um, some tight end for the Texans went. That's surprising. Jordan. I'm going uh Devin Duvernay. I to, to kind of round out my Lamar stack. Again, probably not expecting a ton, but he's a he's a fun bullet to pair with um Mark Andrews. So I only have three picks left, huh? Yep. I got six running backs, six receivers. Probably gonna cl- and I have two picks left, so probably go one and one. Let's see if there's any other. Oh, Nico Collins went. He was one of the guys I had my eyes on. JD McKissick really falling. Something happened, Ryan. I mean, you're the only one drafting him, I guess. Yeah. The only one who cares about his ATP. Oh, just went. Do we do we like a naked Watson? Deshaun Watson? Oh my God! Darrow drafted Deshaun Watson. What the hell is, is it going a bot on? That's listening to us. Wow, this could be. Is this the uh, algorithm, Ryan? What's going on here? Almost forgot about this guy. Definitely right, drafted. I'm gonna him. take my backup quarterback and stack with Drake London. Marcus <laughs> Mariota. Goes to Ryan. I can't believe Darrow right in front of you. Darrow sucks. What a horrible person Darrow is. No, I mean, just he literally has no anything goes on Darrow's team. <laughs> no chemistry. <laughs> You're worse than the Browns, sir. Wow, that is Ryan. That's brutal. I I really don't want Darrow Darrow to listen. Maybe if you could just skip my voice when you're listening. Uh, Austin Hooper goes. Some interesting picks. I feel like we're saying some names that we don't normally say in some of these drafts. That's because Darrow's here. Back up. A lot of players without a team. Yeah. Uh, although Beckham, you could make a case because imagine he comes back with the Rams for those last. Like he he gets signed week ten. He might be a guy that you know. No. I mean, he's not. I don't know. I feel like you're. You're. Uh, do I stack a, someone else with Tom Brady? That's the question. <laughs> what? Yeah, of course. Or do I look to add to my big game since he Buffalo s- s- game stack? Odell Beckham goes uh, like you just said uh, Devonta Foreman, Marlon Mack, John Mechie, Brian Robinson. I mean of those Brian Robinson to me is the most interesting as far mm-hmm. as like massive upside Paris Campbell. He's got dude potential. He's a potential dog. Julio Jones. Another know. guy without a team. Remind people of that. What's the, what's our take on uh, Logan Thomas? <clears throat> When's he coming back? He'll be back for the season, right? Logan Thomas? Yeah, what's yeah. Our take I think there? by all accounts, um, Andrew Robb, I think, seemed okay drafting him. He's our uh, Washington Commandos insider. Kramer, you're on the clock. Donovan Peoples Jones just got drafted. Yeah, I'm gonna take the former Hokey. I need a third tight Logan end. Logan Thomas. Need a third tight end. And I will uh I'll get my last receiver here around the other side. Carson Wentz like likes uh chucking it high. Logan Thomas is six six. Yeah. It's a good pairing. He's definitely has a preference for tight ends. Likes likes a good <laughs> tight end. And the Lord. And the Lord. Taro to Carson Wentz. It's a bot. It's listening in this this room as we speak. We have a bug. Daro, <laughs> Daro, yeah, it's AI. I said Carson. It's we like said, that, that chat bot that went sentient. We never said Raheem Mostert though. That was uh. That was what he that was learned. <laughs> that was AI machine learning. All right, all right, let's go look at my other teams. Maybe they're better. 
James Robinson goes, Ooh, you know, I'm taking some Zamir white. <laughs> we discussed that earlier. I like Zamir white and he helps round out my Raiders stack. Oh, so thirsty. Receivers are a little thin, but you know, Devonte Adams, Jalen Waddle. Oh, good Lord. What happened? All right, so this is one of the teams I auto drafted: Lamar Jackson, Daniel Jones, Naheem Harris, Najee Harris, Saquon Barkley, Tony Pollard, Rashid, Rashad Penny, Khalil Herbert, T. Higgins, Jerry Judy, Traylon Burks, Drake London, Kadarius Tony, Garrett Wilson, Henny Galladay, Wandell Robinson, Logan Thomas, Hayden Hurst, and Evan Ingram. Shout out to me for having my rankings be able to generate something so beautiful. Ryan, last shot for me for a receiver. I think I need an extra receiver. I only have two, three. I only have six receivers. Little you went there. <laughs> you went. Uh, you Isaiah wouldn't believe McKenzie, it, Sean. Jawan Jennings, Kendrick Bourne, Justin Ross. I was gonna take Isaiah McKenzie, but you can have him. Uh, you really want him? No, this whole draft has gone horribly. <laughs> you should take Dearness Johnson. Really? I don't know. I feel like I need a receiver. I'm going to go Isaiah McKenzie. Okay. That's okay. Uh, I should have taken Juwan Jennings. Damn it. All right, Ryan, final pick. Got to be feeling great about your draft right now. I feel awesome. I just feel awesome. <laughs> I actually feel like I'm going to get the steal of the draft right here. Because is there any? Well, this this bot Daro. Daro, I, take I will down. not speak his name. He's there could be cameras though. If there are cameras behind me, he will know who I'm about to pick. So I ha- I do have it clicked, ready to go. One more. I shouldn't say he. Say Jones. They, Mark Ingram. Dolchich, Ingram. Horrible pick. Horrible pick. Uh, yeah. Why don't we stack Tom Brady with Tyler Johnson? I mean, I Ooh. think he's the guy, right? Chris okay. Godwin's filling. I mean. I, I don't have Gronk on the team, Sean, but I ended up with a Tom Brady, Fournette, Tyler Johnson, Cameron Brait. Got Mariota stacked with Drake London. Got a shitload of Bills and and Bengals. Good draft. Fuck Daro. Let's go eat some lunch. Anything else to add? Um, no. I'm I'm pretty happy about my zero RB so, strategy. I'm going to consider. Using it moving forward, Ryan. My final team is Lamar Jackson, Derek Carr, Miles Sanders, Tony Pollard, James Cook, Isaiah Spiller, Khalil Herbert, uh, Davis Price of the Niners, and Zamir White for my receivers: Devontae Adams, Jalen Waddle, Hunter Renfro, Jamison Williams, Lavisca Chenault, Devin Duvernay, Isaiah McKenzie, and my tight ends: Mark Andrews and Darren Waller. Feel great about my lineup, Brian. How about you? Oh, it's just of course, right? Tom, right as it ends. Okay, Tom Brady, Marcus Mariota, Leonard Fournette, J.K. Dobbins, Kenneth Walker, and Rashad Penny with Michael Carter, Jamar Chase, T. Higgins, Gabe Davis, Drake London, Garrett Wilson, Jamison Crowder, Robbie Anderson, Tyler Johnson, Noah Fant, Cameron Brait, and Logan Thomas. Sean, would you know? That one of the auto drafts, I ended up with Tua and Ryan Tannehill. <laughs> my my oh rankings my just have the quarterbacks too low. I, I have to reevaluate. I think. Yeah, need to uh, need to need to boost up those All right. QBs. All okay. right, thank you guys. Thank you for participating in the Sports Gambling Podcast. Toss us a nice rating and review over at Apple Podcasts. Submit you that screenshot of you uh, writing up the rating and review. Take that screenshot, upload it on the SGPN app over on the contest tab for your chance to win free gear every Monday, AKA merch Monday for the sports gambling podcast. I'm Sean stacking the money green. And he is Ryan Sean by Danny dimes. Ownership is under 80%. Kramer. Let it ride.